Hey guys, Mechanic CG here, and welcome back to another episode of Tourist Trophy. Today is episode number 33. If you guys do want to stay up to date with the rest of the Tourist Trophy series, then make sure to subscribe and hit that notification bell. And make sure to check out the links in the description for our socials. We've got Instagram, Discord, and Twitter. But hopefully you guys do enjoy today's video. Right, we are here for race number 18, event number 18, whatever you want to call it. This is the uh, Eurostar series. Um, oh, there we go. Finally loaded. Uh, what we're going to be doing uh, is we're going to be taking this Aprilia. I think that's what it's called. And the game's just crashed on me. The disc isn't spinning. What's going on? Hang on. <laughs> Okay, so hopefully all the problems have been fixed. I had to unplug it. Everything just stopped working, which uh, a little bit worrying. Um, but here we go, the Eurostar series. We're going to be taking the Aprilia, and we are going around three tracks. We're starting off with the Apricot Hill Raceway, moving to Midfield Raceway, and then Trial Mountain. Let's do this. Right, so we're at Apricot Hill Raceway. Again, it happened again. It stopped reading the disc. Can you just work, PlayStation, please? I beg. Don't die on me. Um, but we are here. We're going to do this race three laps around April Cot Hill Raceway. I would have liked to uh, it have been five laps per race, but three laps is okay. I think I might have to put two championships in one video for this. But that also depends on how long the next one is. Because if the next one's too long, then it's going to be a short video today. And if the next one's short, then it's going to be a long video today. That makes sense. Hopefully. <laughs> this bike's really cool, though. The way those... Um, Exhaust sort of like cross over each other towards the exit. That looks pretty cool. Oh, we've gone wide. Brilliant. Right, so how much time do we have to regain? About five seconds, I'd say. Maybe six. 5.3. But we are somehow, somehow, gaining that time quite easily, so. The fact is, the other two... Ooh! Horrendous braking zone there. The uh, other two bikes are so close to each other that we get one, we get the other, pretty much. Nice. I can still hear the PlayStation disc drive working. Oh, come on! That's it. Game over. Ruined it. Brilliant. Ah, it means I'm going to have to redo this race, probably. Unless we do a massive 125cc again. Which we probably won't.
Come on, just get around the corners. One point five seconds. If we don't fall off at the end, we could get this still. Okay, okay. Staying on the road just about. Let's get that good exit. Come on. Right, watch out for the chicane that is coming up in a minute. Oi, stay back. This is my position, not yours. Awesome. We are ahead. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Awesome. And across the line. Finish. Perfect. 0 0.7 seconds ahead. With a uh, 4 minute 34 time. Decent. It obviously isn't a championship as well, so we're going to get a bike out of every single race today in this event. Out of all three races, so let's go. And here we go, the Suzuki GSX 1300R Hayabusa. Ooh! Hey, that looks awesome! Look at the size of that! That's crazy! That's crazy big! That's a big bike! We got our number on there as well. Number 69. <laughs> right, next up is the Midfield Raceway. Let's go and take a look at this. I quite like the Midfield Raceway. Except for the final section. That's an absolute nightmare. Always. No matter what. So, uh, obviously going against BMW Motorrad's Triumph Speed Triple. Let's go. Get ready to ride. I think I sung over the start sound, so that really tripped me out. I was expecting a start sound. Nice. Here we go, 5.5 seconds we need to gain. Starting on the brakes a little bit earlier for this corner to make sure we do get round safely. Oh, okay, come on, come on, come on. Nice. 3.1 seconds, that's decent. Perfect. And where is he breaking zone for this corner? Let's break now. Oh, oh, bit wide. Definitely lost about half a second then, easily. Awesome. That's good. That's very good. Come on. Perfect. Let's go flat out now. And then onto the brakes for here. And then onto the brakes again. Oh. Ah, oh, we messed that corner up. It's that banking always messes us up. 
Obviously, that road is closed. We need to watch out for that. What are you doing? Get back here. Don't be stealing my win. That's my win. Perfect. Nice. This has been one of the uh, shorter races or series or whatever. It's been much shorter. Do you know, this? that's actually really weird. This is the um, Euro series. And we won ourselves a Suzuki, a Japanese bike. That is very peculiar. Oh, I've done it again. We've ruined it. Hang on, hang on, hang on. No! No! <laughs> We've lost so many positions. No! <laughs> Uh, I'm gonna have to redo that right so we're here at the raceway now, and this is uh, attempt number two the last race didn't go so well Can guarantee you I've cut that out Awesome Five point two seconds we need to gain now. Ah, not great, not great, okay. Nice. Oh perfect. Right, we need to watch out for this corner. We did crash twice in this section, which is what caused us to lose. So we have to take a very slow, very gradual line here. There we go, perfect. Nice. There's no one in the stands, I've just noticed. The stands are empty. Nobody likes motorbike racing, apparently. Or maybe the PS2 just uh, predicted the pandemic. Who knows? No, no, keep it going. Nice. And there we go, floor it, and we are in first place now. The big number one there. Awesome. Perfect. I can't do a wheelie because I'm going too quick. It's not fair. It won't let me show off. Oh, I've got it. Messed it up. Oh, that was so close. Nice. Perfect. Let's see how we do around the final section though. That is the important thing. Go, go, go. Nice.
nice. And here we go across the finish line. Nice. Three minutes 55 that took. That took longer than the last attempt. And I crashed twice on the last one. And yet I won this one. This game confuses me. But there we go. That was very good. Uh, let's go see what bike we got. I would like something nice, please. Something like the last one was really good. What did we get? Oh, Triumph Daytona. Oh! Oh, I like that. I like that a lot. Wow. That is a very nice bike. Okay. That color scheme is amazing. Okay, next up is Trial Mountain. This is going to be the final race of this series. Of this uh, event series. And then we'll go to the next one. Uh, I'm not actually sure what the next one is. It is a championship though, so it might be longer. It might take longer. Aprilia RSV 1000 going against a Speed Triple and two K1200Ss. Oh no, one's a S, one's an R. Close enough. Here we go, Trial Mountain. The dodgiest track in this game. Awesome. Perfect. I love these corners so much the way that they flow. Nice. Okay, slow down now. Obviously, that straight section is very risky to take a bike at full speed. Awesome. Perfect. Look at that overtake. Awesome. The speed that this bike can carry through the corners on Trial Mountain is insane. I wouldn't recommend it though. Perfect. Nice. Slow down a bit there. Get over the crest and then slow down. Perfect. Stay back. I'm on a red bike. I'm the guy here. I'm the bad guy. Duh. Oh! 
nearly lost it there. The rear kicking out there as well. Perfect. All oh, slow down, slow down, slow. Oh, that was going way too quick for my liking. Nice. And here we go, come on. Let's do this. Finish it off. Here we go, across the finish line. Ta-da! That was decent. Four minutes 58. I sort of zoned out part way through that. Because I was just like focusing, not falling off. But yes, that was a very good race. One of the uh, more boring events so far, um, because it just wasn't long enough, there wasn't any exciting vehicle. Oh, pardon me. <laughs> any exciting vehicles. But uh, yes, that was fairly decent. And there we go, Kawasaki GPZ900R. Is it going to look good? It's... Hmm, I don't know. I don't know whether I like that. It's okay. But uh, I think I would prefer a different bike if it was more closed off. It seems very open and I'm not a great fan of the look of those bikes. Hmm. I have a feeling that number plate as well would definitely affect aerodynamics. But uh, that is the Eurostar series done. Uh, and next up is going to be the Two Stroke Legends series. So thank you guys so much for watching. If you did enjoy, be sure to leave a like, comment down below and subscribe. If you want to help support the channel, then make sure to hit that join button or hit that merch link in the description. And don't forget to check out the description for our social links. We have Instagram, Discord and Twitter. But thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you in the next one. Goodbye.